Hi, this is Doug Joseph with Design It Studio, and I want to show you my wall-mounted panel saw and mention to you a little bit about the dust collection. Let me flip the camera around so that I can show you better. So this is my Evolution multi-material saw mounted on a sliding rig that is made with a heavy-duty uh, electrical conduit bought from the big box home improvement stores and I have not yet made the final slice through this thick aluminum platen that I have here and I also have not mounted the uh, sliding stop uh, that I have uh, arranged to put on here but I wanted to not only show you that the slide motion is counterbalanced with 3D printed pulleys using uh, woven uh, steel cable that leads to uh, counterbalance conglomeration of counterbalance weights. And it allows the saw to be as effortless going up as it is going down and basically stops wherever you put it. I also wanted to mention that just as uh, just as described on the Stumpy Nubs woodworking channel, uh, the little tiny small ports for dust collection that are commonly on small handheld tools are really more appropriate for shop vacs rather than for dust collection. Uh, like single stage dust collection units like uh, the five horsepower Harbor Freight. One of the reasons is there's just not enough airflow and it can choke off the, uh, the air supply into the unit. And so what I did uh, in order to attach this one to my glass gate and my uh, four inch dust collection system is I designed and 3D printed uh, a conglomeration that allows additional pathway for additional airflow so that the um, dust collection unit won't be starved for air. I also wanted to mention that just this type of, of design work, being able to design and 3D print your own uh, hose to hose or hose to port connections is really worth the price of admission into 3D printing. I've custom designed something here that no one on earth has ever conceived or made. There's no injection molded product that would fit what I've, what I've done here. And I also wanna mention that this Evolution multi-material saw will cut through steel. This thing is really amazing. And uh, I'm so excited to be able to have it mounted in a way that I've got T-clamps, I've got uh, T-tracks with T-clamps that I can tighten down on the material. And I'll put a link in the description both to the saw uh, and to various other items that have been shown in this. But in addition to 3D printing the, the hose connection, I also uh, remixed a V1 engineering uh, uh, mount to create these, I call them Z mounts. Um, and so I'll put links in the description to all of those items. Again, this is Doug Joseph with Design 8 Studio, and I wish you happy making.